Hey there, everybody. Phil here for AndroidCentral.com. Now, we normally don't do video reviews of chargers, but this is the Nexus charger, so it's Nexus-y and sticky, and let's just take a look at it here. So uh, here's the box. Google's actually done quite a job with the packaging on this guy. And open it up, and the first thing that strikes you is this thing's tiny. It's a really little charger. Now, I'm having a hard time getting it out of the box here, and I'll show you why in a second. The bottom of this thing is very sticky, so when you take the protective plastic off and uh, put it back in the box, it doesn't want to come out again. So when you take it out the first time, it'll be much easier. And here's why. Again, these sticky pads down here on the bottom. Now, you're going to need to keep them clean, right? And it's obviously sticking to that, but uh, it works really well. We'll show you more of that in a second. So inside, you have this uh, little like quick start book that tells you how to use the charger, I guess, if you don't know how to use a wireless charger but anyway uh warranty stuff whatever and also inside get out of the way see it's sticky uh we've got this charger now this outputs at 1.8 amps which is actually pretty respectable for a wireless charger right and then you've got this uh removable plug for it i assume so they can do uh european versions and you know just different regions and then micro usb because that's what it uses so let's pick this thing up again all right yeah plug it in Micro USB plugs into the uh, back. You see, it's nice and shiny. There's the sticky pad again, and there's the micro USB port. So all you do is plug it in, and you're good to go. It's that easy, right? So uh, once you do that, you're going to need a phone. We'll put it down here, and there's the phone. And that's all you got to do. It starts charging. This has a really, really slim profile. Um, you know, it's not going to take up much room on your desk. Now, Nexus 4 right? The Nexus 4 will work, but it's still sliding all over the place. The Nexus 5, however, has magnets in it. So it's, watch this, just watch. Whee! I mean, that's, I'm having way too much fun doing that, I know. But it really is that strong. That's the thing. So you got to shake it to get it loose. In fact, let's just do this. So if you really wanted to, you could charge the Nexus 5 vertically. I don't recommend this. Don't try this at home. But it does stick there so long as those pads are clean. So there you go, guys. A quick look at the brand new wireless charger for the Nexus 5 and other Nexus devices. See ya.